Hi, I'm Bennett Schneider, and this is a vlog bringing you news about protests around the Los Angeles and Southern California area. Protests for gay equal rights, the right of gay people to marry. This is a right that was written into the Constitution and was made available by the State Supreme Court on June 17th of 2008. Those rights were taken away by the passage by a 4% margin, very narrow when you're talking about a statewide vote on gay rights, uh, by Proposition 8, uh, uh, which passed on Tuesday, on Election Day. I have a report from uh, one of our protesters who was at the Mormon Temple protest today. Uh, it started uh, at 2 p.m. at the Mormon Temple on Santa Monica Boulevard at Overland. Today, thousands of protesters gathered in front of the Mormon Tabernacle on Santa Monica Boulevard and Overland. The massive group of protesters marched around the entire perimeter of the temple and shut down Santa Monica Boulevard, Sepulveda Boulevard, Westwood Boulevard, Wilshire, and the surrounding areas. One supporter of Prop 8 actually exited his car in the middle of the street and physically assaulted a protester. The protester was taken away in an ambulance while it seemed that the assailant and his passenger were arrested. Also, other supporters of Proposition 8 came to harass the protesters and actually started a group physical assault on Prop 8 opposers. Police handled the scuffle, removed the violent assailants who support Proposition 8, and it is rumored that they will be charged as hate crimes. More when it comes in. The noises that you hear during this vlog are my AOL Instant Messenger and my iChat Instant Messenger as I receive reports from people at the protests and who were at the protests now at home. At this very moment, the protests continue in West Hollywood and in front of the Mormon uh, Temple in Westwood. Uh, there's a crowd of about 200 people in uh, uh, Westwood at the Mormon Temple and a crowd of about 200 to 300 in West Hollywood, where about 20 minutes ago, Gore Vidal, in a wheelchair, was brought into the intersection of San Vicente and Santa Monica Boulevards, where the protesters were, and he spoke at some length to the protesters there. A historic occasion, Gore Vidal in the streets with the protesters mm. protesting for gay equality. Here now is some information on protests that you can join in on. Tomorrow afternoon in West Hollywood Park behind the bank building that is on off San Vicente Boulevard just south a few doors south of Santa Monica Boulevard there will be a sign making at 1 p.m. in the park bring scissors magic markers glue glitter whatever you like to make signs and that will be for a protest which at this point we're told is going to occur somewhere around 6 or 7 p.m. at the Beverly Center Beverly Center is of course between Beverly and 3rd on La Cienega or between La Cienega and San Vicente. Also, there is going to be a protest in Long Beach, California. It will start at Redondo and Broadway at 7 p.m. That's a protest in Long Beach at Redondo and Broadway. You, you meet up at 7 p.m. and you'll be marching from there. Also, there's word of a protest tomorrow night at 7 p.m. in Orange County, in Costa Mesa in Orange County. I'm sorry, I don't have an exact location. The time is 7 p.m. for Orange County's uh, gay rights protest. There is also a protest, I believe it is tomorrow, at the Oasis, tomorrow night at the Oasis, which is, I believe, in the Inland Empire. Sorry if my sources are a little sketchy. This is my first broadcast. We'll get better as we go along, I promise. If you have information on protests in your area, please send them in with a message to this YouTube video or to my YouTube channel. This just in, the protest at the Mormon Temple was five to 7,000 people strong, stretching an entire city block, uh, was covered by CNN uh, and the national news, it's, uh, uh, national news and international news uh, coverage started at about 7.30 and the news in the state of Utah at 4.30. Utah being significant because it is the capital of the Mormon church is uh, in Salt Lake City, Utah and the Mormon church is reputed to have donated a large, large percent of the funding for the Yes on Proposition 8 campaign, much of it coming from their supporters out of state. I want to make clear it wasn't the church itself that provided the funding. It was rather that the church leadership urged their followers to donate. 
While Gore Vidal was speaking, the dance club Rage, right there in West Hollywood at the intersection, gave out free water bottles. They had all of their wait staff and bartenders carry out free water bottles for all the protesters. Thank you, Rage. We're a community that sticks together. What you're looking at right now is video of Gore Vidal speaking in the streets of West Hollywood at the No on 8 protest rally tonight around 9.30 p.m. Watch for full video on this channel and other Facebook, MySpace, and YouTube locations. One final note, there is to be a protest in Los Angeles in Silver Lake at Sunset Junction on Saturday. I hear it is at 6 p.m. on Saturday in Silver Lake at Sunset Junction where Santa Monica Boulevard and Sunset Boulevard join. Thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for being concerned about the protests and about the equal rights of all people in California. We'll see you during the next report. Coraggio.